Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to transfer your Spotify playlists over to Google Music All Access. So if you're not aware of Google Music All Access, it's a new platform from Google uh, that allows you to add playlists, unlimited songs, that kind of thing. So if you have all your uh, music in Spotify, this is the way to transfer it over. We're going to be using an application called Portify. Portify is a cross-platform application that you can download from this website. I'll also paste the address in the description for this video. Uh, but if you go to that website, uh, go ahead and download the uh, zip or tarball for your particular machine. There's Windows, Mac, and Linux. So I'm on a Mac machine, so I downloaded the uh, Mac zip. And then you're going to go ahead and extract that. And uh, once you do, I'll go ahead and drag this over. You're going to see an app.sh file. So if you right click on that and open it in the terminal for your machine for Windows, a command prompt. Uh, Mac is the terminal, and Linux is the terminal. It's going to start an application. So you can go ahead and minimize the terminal, don't exit it. And uh, then you'll see this new application here, called Portify. So we're going to go ahead and get started. Uh, the first thing, the easiest part, is logging into your Gmail account. And if you're concerned about security at all, um, the developer has stated that this is an entirely local application, so there's no kind of um, information being sent to his servers at all. Everything's just running on your machine and con connecting directly to Google. All right, so now the next part here is logging into Spotify. Uh, so this part's a little bit more difficult depending on whether you've logged into Spotify with a user account and password or if you've logged into Spotify with a Facebook account like most people. Uh, if you use a username and password, you can just use that right here. If not, you need to set up a specific uh, device password through the Spotify website. So go ahead and log into Spotify.com with your Facebook account. And then you can either search Google for something, uh, a string such as device password in Spotify, or you can just click the link that I'll paste in the description of this video. And once you get there, uh, you're going to see that you'll have a device username, and you're going to click the button that says send email to set password. So it will send you an email, you have to click the link, then you'll get to another page, enter the new password, hit save, and you'll be done. So once you finish, you can come back here and enter the username, which is just a string of letter, or, uh, numbers here and the password that you set. And once you're finished, you should see all of the playlists that you've set up in Spotify, all the playlists that you've subscribed to, uh, pretty much everything. So just check the ones that you want to transfer over to Google Music, uh, and then hit Start Transfer. I've already done this, so I'm not going to start yet. But once you do, you'll see a little uh, progress bar. It'll try to find all the songs that you have on there. Um, when it's finished, it'll let you know, and you can log into Google Music, and you should see the new playlist that's been created. Now, if you don't have uh, every song that's been added, if you notice there's some missing, that's because Spotify and Google Music have different libraries that are available to them. But the nice thing about Google Music is that you can supplement the playlist um, songs that it found in its collection with your own MP3 files. So if you're missing some, just download the MP3 and upload it manually. So that's everything. I uh, hope this all works out for you guys. If you have any questions, just uh, leave a comment and I'll try to help you out.